we are 90 minutes away from a place in the Copa del Rey final. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel with me, Andrew, and yes, it is Cup Semi-Final Day. But first, we take on Atletico Madrid. Atle Why did I say Atletico? Atletico Madrid in the league because this has become a fight on two fronts. You guys were here for the 3-0 win over Espanyol. We then rested everyone and we lost 1-0 to 20th place Malaga. Well done, guys. Then we played the first leg against Villarreal and as you'll see there, we were 3-0 up and I was like, well, this is going to be easy on camera, isn't it? And then they scored two late goals and it's 3-2 and it's all finely poised and lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, then we beat Almira 3-1 which uh, we had a week between games, so I played everyone great. In the league, we are joined on points with Atletico with Atleti. We've played a game less than them though, so if we can beat them here, we go three points clear. Win our game in hand, we could be six points clear in fourth, heading towards possibly the Champions League. And of course, we have Villarreal in the Copa del Rey semi-final, so let's get to it. So Lammers is injured, uh, Ben Smith is suspended, Madsen's still injured. So it's going to be Carranza and Karakaburu up front, Shelabert in behind. We'll go with Gonzalez and Ruiz. That, uh, it, it should be that those two work the other way around. I keep fighting it. I keep fighting it. Uh, Wood Faze will play DM. Rul Alvarez is back uh, at right back. Arno Martinez comes in for Ben Smith. We've got Pablo Perez back as well, which is huge. He is... Uh, he can play. He can play. Uh... We can mix it up for the, the cup game. We probably don't want the last one on the bench. Have we got anyone else? No. No, we don't. An absolutely huge game away against Atleti. Uh, they've got, oh, Chelly, he's good. Thomas Lamar's good. That Beto guy scored loads of goals against us. Our form is up and down, but we have to, we've had to rest players. I think that's the maybe the problem with the squad. I need to look at the squad depth, possibly, in the summer. If we get any money. So... Defeat is bad, a draw is fine, a win is amazing. There's not been a single highlight in the, the first half. Welcome to the channel, guys. Drop a like on that for more of this fascinating content. We're actually dominating them a little bit. Shot save, Gelabert. Save, blocked, off target. That'll be a header. Header. Header, yeah. Huh. They're really compact as well, aren't they? Let's go wider, let's pass any space, let's run at them and see what we can do. We've dropped the old revenge. Uh, it took Atleti 30 minutes to get their first shot on goal. I even had to check it, it's definitely on key highlights and not commentary only. This has been a thriller, hasn't it? So I've switched Ruiz and Gonzalez around. I've brought on uh, Lassen, even though he's injured, but he comes back tomorrow. Uh, John Karakaburu is about to come off. Last chance for Karakaburu! Hits the keeper. Oh, do we go for it? Do we go for it? I don't care about the suspension for Arnold Martinez. That means nothing. Let's get back a Yoko on and let's. And then that's it. Okay. We kind of have to respect the point, I suppose, away from home. Throw in. Giving it straight away. And this is really laggy. I'm sorry, everyone. CPU's down at 7%. I don't know what's going on. Ha! Huh. If you know from me, a point at the start, I would have taken it, but we kind of dominated and didn't get the results we needed. Everyone up front didn't play well. Defence played well. Fair play to them. So it leaves us joint on points with them. A game in hand. Sociedad are in third, and we're two points away from them. Valencia, two points behind us. We're playing Elche, and it's a penalty... And Hugo Felix tucks it away, one double struggled and the game is lagging and I'm not sure what to do about it. Yes, hopefully a league win. Big one that one, look at those numbers, only three shots for Elche, we absolutely dominated them. Good win, let's roll on to the semi-final in the cup now. For some known no reason, they have moved the Villarreal second leg to the 14th of March. Huh. Probably wouldn't have rested everyone against Elche then. Just the it's not 1 1 0, but it's not the point. Bear with me a few moments while I just play through these two games and we get to the semi final. What is this game doing to me? 63 minutes into the first leg, I was confident of making the final. 
they came back and scored twice, and then we've nil nil against Atletico, which you saw, no highlights. One nil against Elche, which was a penalty. We've then lost 3 1 to Granada, where their uh, phase got sent off, and then they destroyed us. And then we just drew one each with uh, Bilbao, and we did absolutely nothing until the 91st minute. Uh, so the confidence in going through to the final of this Copa del Rey has massively dropped. Okay, here we go. Here's the team to face Villarreal, second leg, 3 2 up. Uh, Karakaburu, Lamos, Jelabert, the kind of front three. Ruiz and Gonzalez, Markovic is DM. Pablo Perez, Smith, Stoicic, and Alvarez, Etienne Green in goals. Every game, Markovic just chooses violence. You just say hello to him, it's like, aggressive, aggressive. So he's going to get sent off today, isn't he? We're not in good faith. Faith bomb, what am I saying? We just need to score as many goals as they do. But that might be the problem. We're still two points ahead of Valencia and the chase for four minutes of penalty. These never not get given. Six minutes in. Fucking Rabio. Adrian fucking Rabio. So we're, we're all tied. Great. Could have held on half an hour, 40 minutes. Nah. That sounds too much like playing good football. Wish Alvarez had fucked off to Bayern now for 32 million. That'd be nice. So if away goals are a thing, they're going through. But there's no chance this game finishes 1-0. Pedro goes back to the keeper. Chase him. That was possible opportunity. Oh, Boniface is in. And that's going to be a goal, isn't it? Yep, of course it is. Fuck me. This basic, basic stuff. As if you're worth a hundred million, you fucking tool. Just runs straight past his face, not even in behind him. Now we need at least two. Here comes Smith. Definitely the better of the two centre backs. Kawakaburu. Shallow Bell's in! One of those games, is it? One of those games. Their guy Boniface is belting it in like the hardest ever hit a shot ever. We've got fucking dickhead Jello Bear blasting over. Right. Can still salvage it. But at this point, I think we're getting knocked out of Copa del Rey. My, my faith in the team has dwindled. Is Alvarez into Karakaburu. Not in him, though. Stoich, Gonzalez. Gonzalez has not been the player that I thought he might be. There's Pablo Perez. Ruiz, Lamos, Gelobert. Back to Perez. Cross it in. Karakaburu has the post. Must be. I don't know what it means. Will, will it say? Will it say the, the tough the connotations? Lovely play. Perez, Karakaburu, great header, hits the post. We have a chance. Jalabel's coming off on a 6.4. Carranza? Uh, Smith just pumps it long to no one. Gets it back. Calm it down, Smithy boy. Gonzalez, Markovic, Ruiz, over the top, looking for Alvarez, ambitious. And then he's out of position. And here comes Pino. Boniface, Perez, mops up well. We will bring Arno Martinez on for Alvarez. Perez, comes inside. Why did you stop there? Smith, Ruiz, Gelabert. I'm taking him off. He's just banged an absolute cracker. <laughs> See that on the yellow bear. I made the decision to take him off ages ago. Let's find that little pocket of space. Oh, 
was a belting hit. Sorry, says, I apologize that would have kept John if I'd known about that. Corner to Villarreal. Smith gets it away. Push out, boys. Push out. Nothing silly, please. Pino Pedraza will intercept it. Karakaburu. Alvarez is still on. Why didn't that work? Carranza! We're going to the final! I nearly missed the goal. Oswaldo Carranza. Makes that assumption look absolutely genius now. Stoicic to Alvarez, who probably shouldn't be on the pitch. He plays the ball in. What am I doing? Carranza absolutely belts it. Let's get Demir on as the last sub. Villarreal definitely need two now, at least. Carranza. Gonzalez. Into Ruiz. Karakaburu back to Keiji Ruiz! I did not see this game going this way. We've knocked in four past Villarreal. Lovely football. Carranza. Gonzalez. Ruiz. Karakaburu back to Ruiz. Lovely one, two. And a fantastic finish. 15 minutes to go. Villarreal need four? Playing for pride now. Pablo Perez takes his time. Kind of puts himself in more trouble. Smith, Markovic, Carranza. It's lovely play again. Ruiz, give it wide. Pablo Perez, options in the box. He's going to shoot. <gasps> Saved by Danny. Corner from Carranza. Goes near post. <gasps> Stoicic is there, just goes over the bar. Praise, 10 minutes to go. We scored four goals in 11 minutes. Unheard of. Martinez. There's Karakaburu. Martinez looks down the channels. Unlucky. Markovic, Lamos, Emery. Good ball to Arnold Martinez. First time ball in. Carranza. Oh, if he was right footed, that might have been. Andorra going to the Spanish Cup final, the Copa del Rey final. I'm not quite sure how that happened. So, Sociedad and Barca don't play to the 21st. Yes, and the final is on the 14th of April, and that is when we will be back. Uh, probably maybe do... Because Valencia are just behind us. We're in the Cup final, the Copa del Rey final. That was the aim of the season. We've somehow done it that four goals in 11 minutes is ridiculous thought we were going out but no in the final amazing guys if you've enjoyed this please drop a like on the video it means a lot to the channel helps us grow gets us on the algorithm all that good stuff uh yeah subscribe to the channel if you've not already i think like 90 percent of you haven't subscribed please get that done if you're enjoying the save let me know let me know in the comment what was your favorite goal there i think the cage Ruiz one for me the little one too lovely yeah thank you guys for watching until next time for me andrew bye for now